Hello, this is the mallet percussion uh, portion of the audition uh, helper video. Uh, and just so you know, I imagine some of you have a glockenspiel or some sort of school uh, bells that you've had for several years uh, to practice on, and that would be just fine to perform this audition on. Uh, it would be great to have a xylophone or marimba or something like you might have at school, but probably don't have access to right now. Uh, so anyway, at home I have a vibraphone, which isn't what I would normally want to play this on, but it works just fine. So here we go. I'll play through the uh, excerpt for you, and then we can talk through a few little things to consider. Okay, so that's basically how this this goes. Um, one thing I want you to note is, although it says quarter note equals 132, I uh, don't feel that you have to play that exact tempo. Uh, I prefer you uh, to be able to play this in a, in, um, a tempo that's comfortable where you can uh, capitalize on, on right notes and good sounds. Uh, so just a few things to consider. The first two, bar, uh, two lines are the same as lines three and four, just a, a louder dynamic. So as you're going through, uh, watch for the key signatures and uh, accidentals. Has that interesting G sharp in there? It sounds kind of, kind of uh, funny but cool. And on this, um, I'm sticking this right, left, right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. So it's a little bit of an awkward lick for us, but but it works if you use that sticking. Uh, as we go down into the fifth line, where it says forte, much stronger here, but notice that the key signature has changed. There's no longer a C sharp, so just be careful about that. And then look at the rhythm that we have. We have one E and, and then a 16th note triplet. I like to count those, two triplet and. So we have one E and, two triplet and, one and a two, one E and, two triplet and, one triplet and, two, and there's that C natural. And then we have the mezzo forte, kind of simple after the other stuff that we've had. Watch out for the B flat in the second bar of this. And then a B natural there. And that repeats. It repeats again an octave higher for a couple of bars. And then we have um, one beat before the final uh, line of the piece. Double forte. And then double stops. Between two triplets, also known as a tremolo, um, just keep the right hand on the E, left hand on the A, and you should be good to go. Don't think about bouncing or anything like that for mallet percussion, just a single stroke roll. Back and forth. All right, happy practicing. I hope you do well.